Hello, Nick Recycled fans and followers. <clears throat> I am sitting in my car. I <laughs> I got a ticket. Parking ticket. At school. And this is because I was late to tutoring. I came down here and I parked in a handicapped spot, ran inside. I was in too much of a hurry to put on my handicap sticker. So I didn't and I got a ticket for that. They're expensive. For those of you who park in handicap spots without handicap stickers, I'm sorry. So I had to go in today to refute, to uh, request forgiveness for my my shortcomings of forgetting my pass, putting out my, my tag. I don't like to have, okay, so for me, this is for Nick Maniscalco. I have a, a blue handicap sticker thing. This thing that rides in the window. Um, I have that because I don't want to get a license plate. I mean, I, I can do that. I could have a license plate and have it all fine and dandy. And that would be that would work okay for a little bit. But I buy and sell cars. I and I when my car doesn't work, I use my mom's car or something like that. So I change and so I can't carry my plates if I just randomly change. So I brought the I I have the tag. Um for those of you who uh, there are people out there that drive around with the handicap sticker hanging from their driver's window. Or their their driver the the rear view mirror. Yes. I, I don't know if this is even legal. But on top of that, like, I don't think it should be because it's a, a vision abstraction or obstruction vision. I don't know. You can't see through it. So it obstructs your your vision. <laughs> um, yes, I think that that should be done away with. Man, yeah, no, nah. So I, that's why I have my sticker, I my my tag, and I throw it out on my dash every time I park. I don't. <gasps> Excuse me. I don't park on handicap stick, uh, handicap spot places often, except for at school, because I get free parking if I'm with that tag. And at school, I'm usually late, so it's nice to be a couple seconds earlier than I would have been. Um, oh, I was looking at my beard yesterday. I am getting gray hairs. I'm getting old. Although... My brother has a lot of a lot more gray hair than I do. Um, but I'm only 33. I'm not saying that he's too much older than me, but I don't know. It's just like, hmm, wow. Um, and then I was thinking today, I was like, hmm, well, that's a bummer. But at the same time, I don't really care if I get gray hairs. Oh well, I'm not gonna dye them back to a certain color. Um see here, I'm sorry, I'm trying to trying to hold this in the, in a good light for a good eh, oh well. So um I was like well I could I have gray hairs and I don't care. Um but I was like well I wonder like I was just I don't know what I was thinking, but I was thinking about um, dyeing them, and I was like, well, I could dye my hair, yes, but why? God has blessed me with 
the hair that I have and the hair that I'm losing. But I have a hair still as of today. What is today? The It's Tuesday or Wednesday. I think it's Wednesday. Pretty sure it's Wednesday. Um, I don't know, 26th? I'm not sure. And I can't look. I use my phone for all that. So anyway, um, what was I talking about? Dying your hair. And I was like, you know what? I don't care. Gray hair or not gray hair. Well, I'll be blessed if I have gray hair. Because my hair is falling out. So they say that your, um, your hair gene is supposed to come from your mother's father's genes, or your mother, it's your grandpa, your mother on your grandpa's side. Supposedly that's how it works out. Well, my mother, my mother's father had hair. My father's father does not. Like, he's bald. He has that cul-de-sac thing going around the side of his head. Um, and they, but they say that you're supposed to get your hair gene from your mother. Your mother's father, I think it is. Well, my hair is thinning. And I don't know if I'm going to go bald or if I'm not. But at the same time, I was like, you know what? I've... So, I think I've told you guys about me having long hair back in the day. That's why I grew my hair out. Because I am slowly but surely losing my hair. As At least that's what it feels like. Um. So, oh well. Yeah. Um... I'm sorry, today I'm just rambling on and on. I don't know what I'm talking about. But this is Nick's life. <laughs> sorry. Alright. Thank you for... <laughs> if you've made it this far in life... <laughs> if you made it this far in this video, not in life, in this video, I'm very impressed. Um, Thank you for supporting me in watching my my episodes um i will catch you later uh yeah thank you for coming and watching peace out